What is going on, everybody? It's DGen Rips here, and this is how to blow forty dollars in five minutes. Because we got gems of the game basketball here. At least it says basketball, and it says one card graded, guaranteed BCCG nine point oh or higher. And they put a PSA card on the front. I don't know how they get away with this. It's always a BCCG card. Um, I would ask why do they even make this crap? But here I am just buying three of them. So let's see it. Let's see what we can get. I'll try to make this more suspenseful. Let's see. I don't know. Let's flip it around. All right. We got 2009, 2010 upper deck. MJ Legacy Collection Gold. So maybe a Michael Jordan card? Michael Jordan. Huh. Michael Jordan Legacy. 50 greatest players in NBA history. It's a pretty neat card. Worth anything? I have no idea. But it uh, feels like they also stepped it up with the casing for these BCCG cards. It doesn't feel like I could just destroy this with, uh, with the tiniest bit of effort. So we get a Michael Jordan Legacy Collection card. I'll be looking it up at the end to see if it's even worth anything. I feel like they wouldn't give you a Michael Jordan card in this. All right. Box number two. Gems of the game. Let's try to be suspenseful again. All right, it's coming through the back. Flip it around. Oh, it's the same freaking card. Except number 30 of the Michael Jordan Legacy. It's the same freaking thing. Is the, the, I'm guessing the last one will be a Michael Jordan one as well. All right, so two Michael Jordan cards, I guess. So I only assume the last one is also a Michael Jordan Legacy card. Man, I really, I wonder if these cards are even worth anything. All right, very last card here. And what do you know? It's literally the same exact freaking card. How do they get away with this stuff? Seriously. Do you hate do you hate your customers that much? MJ Holdings? I mean, I know that they're slimy as hell because they hired the uh, local card scalper to work for them, if you can imagine. This dude that just the, the the big dude from my videos works for MJ Holdings now because he can't resell anything because that gravy train is over. And if they hired him. They got to be the slimiest company imaginable. So there you have it. Three Michael Jordan Legacy Collection cards. It actually says, look at this. So it says number 30. And then this says number 77. Are they different? Yeah, I guess it is. Yeah, 30 and 77. They're different cards. Same front, different backs. But uh, there you have it. Michael Jordan Legacy Collection. I'll get some comps on this, see if, it, if it's worth anything, if we can at least get some money back. But uh, yeah, anyway, I just want to say, screw MJ Holdings. This is the new gems of the game, the red ones that they're pumping out. It says 2023. Just stay away. Let MJ Holdings, they, someone, one of these days, one of these days, they're going to get what's coming to them. I, I promise you that. And that, that's, uh, <laughs> that's not, that's not a, uh, that's not a threat. I mean, one of these days, there's going to be a class action lawsuit, hopefully. And until then, I just spent the money on this, so none of you guys will. Don't do it. Stay away. This is what you're going to get. Some Michael Jordan collection cards. I don't know. But yeah, I'll get some comps on them, and that'll do it, everybody. Peace. Agent rips with his fingertips He'll go broke by the end of